As you can see here, I've got a cat in front of a green screen and I want to remove the green screen so that, that way it looks like there's a cat in front of a, a red curtain. All right, within the edit page, you want to select your effects and then with effects, you want to go to Open FX Filters, Resolve FX, and look for this one, 3D Keyer. With the video clip selected, double click on it, and then I'll add it to that video clip, or you can drag and drop it to add it to it. Once you've added it, click on Inspector so that you have your Inspector open. Within Inspector, you want this one here called Effects. And you also want to click over here on the left and you want to switch transform to open fx overlay now with open fx overlay just click into the green area with your mouse and you'll see it changes it from black and it changes it to black and white you want to start dragging on the areas with the green screen and you can see what's happening as it's turning to black so if i let up it removed all of the green screen in that area but we still have this down here that's fine press shift with your keyboard and then just drag and move the mouse around some more and we want to get in here and so what you're doing is just trying to get as much of that green as you can and it will remove it but as you can see we do still have a bit of green bleeding into the cat's fur and so what you can do here is with, within your effects panel, you can change your final composition to alpha highlight black and white if you want. And then that will actually give you a better idea of what's being selected and what's not. So you can actually see there's some over here on the right. Let's get that. There's this little patch right here, a little area down here. So I'm just grabbing that. You can also go to matte finesse and within here just your clean black and whites and see if you can get that dialed in it so notice this little piece right here and when I grab my black I'm gonna pull it a bit to the right and you can see it went away and so you can switch it back your output to final composite again if you want to look at it with the image and just keep dialing it in as best as you can with those blacks and whites in order to get rid of as much of that green as you possibly can without removing too much of the image. You also have this one here under behavior options, which is despill. So that's gonna remove some of that green spill that's on, this, on the, the fur in this case, or the skin if it's a person. And you can drag that as well and just play around with it until you get it to where you want it. And you can always go back to doing the shift clicking and dragging a bit with the mouse if you want um, and adjusting your finesse and your despill. So this is good enough for the purpose of this tutorial. You want to make sure when you're all done, you go back down here to where you have your open effects overlay selected, switch that back to transform. And now you can go back and do whatever editing you want to do with your video. As always, hope you found that useful. Have a good day.